like it was a gap and it was a need here in the city of Birmingham, especially in the state of Alabama, for that uh, for that age group. That's an important age group because that's where you transition and get ready to go to um, high school. And I felt like looking around the country, there's a lot of talent that's getting exposure in that age group, but there's none here in Alabama that's getting that exposure. So what I wanted to do was create an avenue for that. I wanted to create an avenue where kids from this city and surrounding cities had the opportunity to go show their talents on a national scale. Um, I really believe there's a lot of talent here in this city that's not been tapped yet, and I wanted to figure out a way to do it. I spoke to a lot of people, and I got a lot of no's and a lot of yeses that turned into no's. I had a lot of people tell me they would do things, and they would do different uh, different uh, things to help me get this team together. I had people tell me they will give me sponsorship. I had coaches tell me they will come out and help. But um, when it all came down to it, I had to realize that it was my dream, and I had to put forth a lot more effort. I did have one collective group of coaches that finally came together and said that they were going to be on board, and I appreciate those guys. I think each one of them will get an opportunity to speak for themselves. Um, the kids that's on this team are kids that really have the talent to go play anywhere in the country, but they've never had the exposure. I wanted to create an avenue for that, and what I did was I, I sat back and I took an inventory of all the kids that we had in this area, in this age range, and I basically put together a team, hand-selected an elite group of guys, and we went out and we started playing outside of this um, outside of this state. What I really want to do is I want to open up the door for kids that may not have the opportunity to go to a high school and play next year. I want to open up the opportunity for kids that might be right in the middle of that cutoff with the 12 and under age range here on the parks that can't play 12 and under because they're about to turn 13. I wanted to open up some doors that wouldn't be open otherwise. Um, it's the first time it's ever been done. It's the first time it's ever been successfully done. There's been a lot of people that try. Um, the Birmingham Bulldogs is a self-sufficient, non-sponsored team. We do everything on our own. Everything comes out of my pocket, my parents' pocket. Um, my coaches, we don't get paid. We don't get anything of that nature. We just do it for the love of the game. We're teaching these guys techniques and we're teaching these guys schemes that will get them prepared for the next level. And we're going out and we're trying to play against the best competition possible. The Birmingham Bulldogs. No smoke, no smoke. I know you don't want it. I can't go, won't go. Won't leave my mama alone. No smoke, no smoke. But we die about that money. No smoke, no smoke. You don't. 